Rubik's Cube, a puzzle which begins and ends again and again. Experience does not equal aptitude. Every time you think you've sussed it, some asshole comes along and fucks it. The light colored sides you spent so long assembling it mixed and muddled in the hands that are trembling. They didn't mean it. Maybe they didn't even know, but back to Rainbow Shepherd Zero you go. People are better at Rubik's than you. They're faster. Somehow they just get it. Even if you're powering through, it's not good enough. The experts are leaving you behind. You're sat in the corner of some girl's flat trying to sort your cube out. Greasing rows of saline, still they won't budge. Drop your cube in someone else's hands. Demand they fix it for you. Twist into self-loathing when it's returned to you with passive, aggressive, sticky notes. Joy of completing a side that feeling of accomplishment is hollowed by the kaleidoscope on the remaining five. The time for pretending is now, as the microphone gets even more echoey. <laughs> <laughs> no one will ever know you're struggling as long as they don't ask how you did it. You put your best face forward. The world doesn't need to see the rest. Eventually, you beat the cube. For real. Schofield cheers in your head. <laughs> you did it. Hard bit over, but the congrats are brief. In comes the dread. Your closet is full of yet to be solved cubes. Life is a Rubik's cube. There's solace in colours. Some cubes are easier than others. Some days are easier than others. Don't get smothered by how many cubes you haven't done. Take them one by one. It's okay to fail. Irregularity is interesting anyway. Thank you. Thank you.